But this breaking news alert. That breaking news tonight. Today, a shooting just a few feet away from a mall in Clarksville then caused a full evacuation there. Thank you for joining us tonight at 10 o'clock. I'm Lydia Fielder. Our Dryden quickly spoke with people who were inside that mall and helped others run for cover. A quiet Saturday morning at the mall turned into full-blown chaos in a matter of minutes. One man who works here says it started when a woman ran inside saying there was gunfire. So she was screaming out shots were being fired. And so as soon as she said that we heard about five to seven more shots rang off. Those shots, he says, sent people running into the store from all directions. It was an extreme amount of chaos. Um, we had people um, rushing in from everywhere from the women's section of the, of the shoes to the, to the suitcases. He says they got as many people inside as they could and then locked the doors and waited for police. We were afraid that there was a possibility a shooter would come in through the main entrance and come into the mall because everything hadn't been locked down and shut down yet. After a few minutes, police came into the store to explain what was going on. They said there was a shooting in the parking lot after two people got into an argument. No one was hurt. The mall closed for a few hours as police did a thorough search. During this, some were more patient than others. It was a few customers that were like, you know, we, we're, kind of, we're trying to return some items. Can I, can I still check out? For many who were there, they said they were thankful for the employees who jumped into action, letting people take shelter. I can check on myself later. As long as I'm still breathing, I still got time to check on other people. So. Police are still looking for the shooter, but they say it was a targeted incident and there's no threat to the public. In Clarksville, Dryden Quigley, WSMV4.